Well, clearly, um, if the Formula One teams were required to go to Russia um, and support the Russian Grand Prix, that was going to be very difficult um, for, for many people to actually sit comfortably with. It was going to be taking a lot of money into Russia and all for all the commercial partners and sponsors. Again, an association supporting Russia in any way was going to sit very uncomfortably. So I think everybody breathed a sigh of relief when the Russian Grand Prix was cancelled. And I, I think I don't think anyone really was in any doubt that this was going to happen. But uh, let me put one thing to you as well. I can understand saying Russia, bad guys, no Grand Prix. Mazapan is punished and loses his job as a driver simply because of his nationality, Russian. No, that's not strictly correct. He actually owes his seat to the sponsorship from his father, Dmitry, who um, towards the end of February actually was at the Kremlin having a meeting with President Putin and has been deemed by the EU as a person of significant interest. Um, he runs a uh, he has associations with a very large chemical company um, producing fertilizers and other chemicals. So Mazepin's seat was directly as a result of the sponsorship of the company owned by his father. So I think the EU um, decided shortly after announcing that his father, Dmitry, was a person of um, association with the Kremlin. Um, shortly after, Nikita, his son, was deemed a natural person associated with the businessman. And that's why he lost his seat.